How have things been since your first UFC victory? Hmm. Is there more pressure? Are you training even harder now because you, you want to stay where you're at? You know, you want to continue to stay in the UFC and, and train hard? And well, obviously, I want to continue making the most money, paying bills, so UFC is the place to be. Um, Pressure-wise, no. I mean, <clears throat> I think I'm at a good spot right now where a lot of people still don't really uh, give me the respect I feel I deserve, and they kind of doubt me kind of put in my performance last time, basing it on how poorly Hollis fought instead of how well I performed, which is cool. I mean, it's all good. So I'm at a good place right now where I'm not really, no real pressures put on me. No one's really expecting too much out of me. So I'm gonna shock the world a couple more times and kind of fly under the radar, keep banking checks. Now, uh, one person who's not flying under the radar is your buddy Dominic Cruz. Uh, who just defeated Brian Bowles at WC 47 on Saturday night. What did you think of Dominic's performance? Uh, it was ridiculous. It was uh, exactly what everybody in the gym thought he was going to do. And, uh, you know, I knew he was going to win. I knew I didn't think it would happen that quick. Um, I, you know, it was a flawless victory. You know, couldn't have asked for anything more. And so, uh, what, what can we expect now from the, the executioner, Joey Beltran, the next time we see you in the cage? Um, next time you see me in the cage, I'm definitely got over the uh, UFC jitters, so I'm coming out slinging them. And uh, look for more dynamic fights. You know, I'm going to try to come out and put on spectacular performances every time.